Bye. Go for it. <laughs> He's gonna be famous. <laughs> this guy's gonna be famous. <laughs> what shoes are you in? Ultra Olympus. The Olympus. I gotta get your opinion on Ultra once we're back in the car. Yeah. Yeah. I got my first pair. I saw. That, hey, is that the knit? Yes. Oh, okay. knit. It is the knit. Yeah. They do two different ones. Yeah, the they don't call it fly mesh. What do they call it? Uh, I think just mesh. Yeah. Something like yeah. Yeah, but it's more a little bit more rigid. Yeah. The knit looked comfortable. It was comfy. That's cool. I got a lot of thoughts on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Intriguing. It's not a. It's not necessarily a ringing endorsement yet. Right? No. Yes. Uh, Definitely not yet, but. <laughs> You know, the funny thing is, though, I've had shoes that I've, you know, hated out of the box. Yeah. And come back to them. Yeah. And then it's like, oh, this is nice. But I think it's just different times. You never know. Honestly, I, uh, I think they're going to be, well, I got a lot of thoughts, but. <laughs> they my, might have a place somewhere in the quiver. My P, my PF felt amazing yesterday. After wearing the the Torrens the day before, okay. So there's a lot of a lot of debate out there about the zero drop and your Achilles and yeah, like how it's all linking together. Yeah, and the and the plantar fasciitis. So, but I will say, I did feel amazing yesterday. Are they? Oh, there they are. Russell, I gotta ask, what is the name of this running group? Castle Rock Run Club. They're Castle Rock. Castle Rock Run Club. You guys are crushing. You guys are crushing it. These guys wake up at like way before the crack of dawn, freeze your butts off, and uh, so thanks for the invite. Hey man, appreciate it. Out. So Good stuff. this guy rallying the troops all the time. That's right. Oh man, it's cold though. It's cold. It's cold. Well, enjoy. It's a good one. Yeah. And uh, I'll, we'll do it again. Sounds good, man. Yeah. What, every loop. week. I try to do them every Wednesday, Friday, but Wednesday, sometimes Friday. we don't. Sometimes we okay. don't get them all. Yeah, but anyway, good trails in Castle Rock, everybody. Good trails, but don't tell too many people. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, I'm at a two out of ten on the pain scale for the PF. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I ran in the peg 35 this morning. 
and 6.4 miles. Basically, since I ran in the Torrent two days ago, things seem to be trending in the right direction. I'm not trying to get too excited. I know there's ups and downs with plantar fasciitis, but right now, it's feeling better. And I'm a little, I'm a little confused as to why, because I did mile repeats last night pretty hard. Go check that vlog out. So I'm just trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure out why, why do I feel better? Why am I walking around basically pain-free? Not quite, but basically. All right, quick shout out to Jen, one of the runners this morning. If you are local in Colorado, there's a winter series of running and just go to pprrun.org, pprrun.org. This is put on by the Pikes Peak Road Runners. Google it and they have a winter series and Jen is involved with organizing this winter series. All right, we're packing. We're getting ready to go on a little, a little vacay, a little vacay up in the mountains. So I'm excited, um, yeah. But first, I'm going to reply to your comments. Oh, my goodness. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Here she comes. This is the way I like to live Here life. Here she At least three drinks at once. Hey, y'all. Uh, Hello. Come oh. on. Vale, here we come. Vale, here we come. Celebrating true love's birthday this weekend. Oh, baby. Oh, yes, thank you. Got you. Good job, baby. I'll take this one. Her. Oh, yes. With He's Michael. Ready. He's ready. Okay, her. okay. Oh, here we go. Baby. We're... Oh wait, oh, too bad, too bad. Made it to Vail, made it to Vail for True Love's birthday. And uh, in the next 20 seconds, two cards are gonna pop out in the upper right hand corner. And those are gonna be links to videos from this past summer where I ran two races here in Vail. Uh, did pretty well, but anyway, upper right hand corner. If you wanna watch old running race videos, uh, click on those and I think you'll enjoy the, uh, the beauty of Vail and uh, some good racing. All right, here we go. Family's asleep, family is asleep, taking a nap, and so, yes, I'm gonna double up today. I'm doubling up, two runs in one day. Haven't really done this in a long, long time, and I'm doing it in the Ultra Torrens for the second run, gonna go three to four miles, easy, bopping along, nine minute pace. But the key word of the day is fun. And the question of the day, based on the title of today's video, is running fun? Is running fun? And before you answer that though, you have to define the term, fun. How do you define fun? So, I will be frank, in high school, running was very, very fun. I was good at it, and so that helps. But in college, I had a lot of injuries. I had stress fractures, lots of stress fractures. I'll talk about that in another video. But in addition, I was trying to keep up on the CU Buffalo's cross country team with future Olympians. And so it was kind of stressful. Like I was in distress a good amount of the time with the injuries and then also just like the pace of the workouts was a little intense for me. I did pretty good sticking in the top, uh, you know, let's say six to nine position on the cross country team, but it was not always fun because I was always kind of worried about keeping up with everybody. So, as you're thinking about answering this question, uh, there's no right answer, all right? And listen, I know plenty of runners, I know plenty of runners that don't do running for fun. In fact, they kind of don't like running. They despise, not despise running, but they don't enjoy it. And they do it simply and strictly for the benefit of their health. So, uh, that's a big question. It's open-ended. I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments. I, is running fun to you? And if not, like, what is perhaps running to you? I know, again, th you know, you gotta hit pause on this video and stop and think for a second. How do I look at running? And maybe, guess what? You may not have an opinion, and that's fine too on this. All right, let's go bop around Vail, Colorado. Even though um, I'm gonna go nine minute pace, we are at 8,000 feet above sea level. So, you know, it'll be a little bit of a workout, but bottom line, I'm doing today's second run because it's fun and I enjoy it, and it's, I love it, I love it. So I'm just gonna go bop around Vail for three miles because it's fun, fun, fun. Oh, get me going guys, get me going again. All right, come on, come on.
that, buddy. 8,200 feet. Yes, that was fun. Oh man, just bopping around at 8,000 feet, finding a snow making machine and uh, just exploring, just exploring. It's a good thing, man, to disconnect from the phone, disconnect from social media, go explore and go have fun while running. And it was fun and good, right, you two? Go, baby. Give me that, I'm gonna put that Ooh. in my mouth. Ooh. I am tired. This runner needs to go to bed. It was an early morning, let's just put it that way. I think I was up at 4.15, yeah, 4.15. So, um, the family's asleep. I'm gonna edit this real quick and um, I then call it a day. Thanks for being here. Thank you for commenting on the question of the day, the keyword, and uh, yes, I did run in the Ultra again today in Vail, Colorado, three miles, not too shabby. It wasn't really long enough or intense enough to give you my thoughts on how it performed today. It was just, a, a, it just did fine. It did fine, it did fine. Love you guys. Thanks for being here. All right? All right? We'll be here tomorrow. We'll be here tomorrow. See beauty. Work hard.